So we're going to start this workout with an eight minutes warm up, okay? So minute one, the whole minute, okay? I didn't, I didn't really set any uh, amount of rest, but obviously being a warm up pace, you don't really want to rush through it. And if you want to get a few seconds of transition, that's totally fine. So make one, down ups, so we start getting down to our three. Up, and we start to stretch. Obviously engage the upper body muscles and stretch your hamstrings by coming up as far up as you can. Then, minute two. Wide grip on your wing pole, and we do snatch grip deadlifts. So, from here, making sure that your chest is nice and high, weight on your heels mostly, and coming up, and all the way through, okay? So take your time, think about your shins being vertical all the time. Then, minute three, a mixer of your choice between the high knees and butt kicks, okay, a few seconds, a few seconds, as long as you're always active through the minute. And then you grab any weight, and you've got, and we do um, squat, goblet squat with five seconds pause at the bottom. So down, one, two, three, four, five, and okay. And two rounds of this. So that's why it's gonna be eight minutes. If you've got questions, this is the moment. Otherwise, get ready for down ups. 10 seconds. Yep, ready. Three, two, one, and start with your down ups. Do you choose the speed? Okay. Try to come up with flat feet or as close to that as possible. Meaning that your hips are coming up really fast and you get that little extra stretch in your hamstrings. Very good, just stand up tall before you do the next bit. Doesn't have to be many. I mean, if you really, really want to do many, do many, but doesn't have to. And keep it going. A comfortable speed, a good pace. We've got 10 seconds before going into snatch deadlifts. Okay, five, four, grab the stick, grab the hole, and start. Okay, so go really deep into your deadlift. Make sure that your shoulder blades are nice and engaged. The Barbell or the any tool you've got in your hand, try to stay on your legs. Okay. Little wider grip, Scott. Good. Really good. Nice and controlled. Not slow motion, but make sure that your back doesn't bend. Okay, maybe another rep, then barbell down, and we go into high knees, hip flex. Let's go. Just a minute of cardio. Really good, just be active, guys, move. Nothing too fancy here. We can even do jumping jacks if you want. Really fancy changing it. <laughs> Be creative. Yes, Alex. Let's go. In 10 seconds, we're going to grab a moderate weight for the pause goblet squats. Okay. So, ready? 
and go. Five seconds in your best squat posture, okay? So make sure that your back is nice and strong, ready to sustain a heavy weight. You don't sustain a heavy weight just now, but imagine you've got it, okay? Five seconds there. Time for a couple more, and then back to down ups. Okay. Okay. We down kettlebell dumbbell and down ups. Second and last round of warm up. You might want to accelerate the speed a tiny little bit. Or a wee bit, I should say. Let's get another one and then grab the barbell for the next part, snatch deadlifts. Let's go. Focus on your straight, strong back, okay? Barbell goes down to mid shin. Try not to sit into it, okay? Keep that tension in your hamstrings. Don't relax completely. Take your time to do it, guys. It's the warm up. Mm -hmm. Strong, slow. Drive your knees out. And then after this, it's going to be the cardio minute. Okay, bar down and get some movement. Keep it going, 20 seconds, then the goblet pose squats. Okay, grab the weight for your last minute of warm up. And make sure that your squat posture stays correct, okay? If you're in a goblet position, elbows and knees should not really touch each other. Never mind if you're using a barbell, that's definitely not gonna happen. Five seconds. Five real seconds. Okay, guys. So, three, two, one, and rest. 
Now, next part. It's going to be strength slash endurance part. Okay, so what we do is five rounds off. One minute work, one minute rest, but the minute of work consists in 40 seconds of overhead squat and 20 seconds of snatch with this exact same weight. Okay, so obviously, if you have a barbell of any sort of weight, okay, you're bringing it up above your head, okay, when the minute starts, you're doing 40 seconds of your best overhead squat. Okay, so making sure that the bar stays in line, okay, not back too far back, definitely not too front. 40 seconds of continuous work. It's not about how many reps you do, but definitely not trying to stop. And as soon as the 40 seconds end, what happens is that from here, down, up, power snatch for the remainder of, of the minute, so 20 seconds. As many as you can. In that case, just go crazy. If you're doing with a dumbbell, that's the exact same thing. You bring it up here. You do your 40 seconds of overhead squats, followed by 20 seconds of snatch. Same thing if you do it with a weight vest, okay? Just a little harder to do. So your overhead squats are going to be really narrow, and then you do ground go overhead for 20 seconds. Any question? What way if you're using a barbell? A lot. Well, I would say 25. So if you have a one, um, so I'm um, a unilateral weight, okay? Something that you can use with one hand only. Or you decide to go for one hand only weight. What you can do is 20 seconds, 20 seconds for the 40 seconds, if that makes sense. So you work the same way um, with both arms. Um, I, don't, I don't see any question, so are we okay? Are we good to go? Good. I was expecting more questions. So, it's five times, so it's going to be a minute rest, um, a minute work, a minute rest. So that makes, obviously, ten times. Yes, okay, that'll work. Okay. Everybody ready? Starting with over squats. 10 seconds. Okay, let's go. Very good. Best quality. Still have 20 seconds to go. Swap if you have one arm. Do if you're using one arm only. Yep. Keep it going. Come on. One more rep. Three, two, one. Straight into snatch. Come on. Quick, quick, quick. 20 seconds. Then you rest for a minute, don't waste it. 
Down and up. Keep it going. Keep it going. Very good. One more. Two. One. Rest. Rest for a minute. So now we know how it goes. It goes quite fast, okay? It's a quick minute. So when it comes to this notch, we need to be super fast. Okay, you've got 10 seconds before going again. Okay, bring the weight above your head. Three, two, one, squat, come on. Really good, well done. I'll tell you when the 20 second change is. Keep going, keep going with the same arm, keep going with the barbell. Push, 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 push. Okay, swap arm if needed. And go again. Stable. When it's snatch time, we go without hesitation. Three, two, one, go. Very good, Devi. Receive the bar ish a little bit lower. Come on, bend your legs. That's it. Couple more. Three, two, one, rest. That's the second minute gone. Okay, that's 20 seconds before we go again. Grab your weight, guys. Bring it overhead, starting in three, two, one, and squats. Nice and straight posture, really good. Straight arm, Pauline. I know it's hard. Yep. Very good, Jules. Awesome depth. Let's go. Swap arm if you need to. Okay. Ready to snatch with no break. Three, two, one. Snatch. Fast, fast, fast. Call me 12 seconds to go. Keep moving, come on. Rest. That's our third minute sorted. Two to go. Not yet, not yet, guys, not yet. That's still 20 seconds to go. 
because it's still the minute of rest is still at 1420. Good spot, Colleen. Good spot. Okay, now we need to get ready. Five seconds. Weight above your head. Three, two, one. Squat. Keep moving. That's good, Scott. Well done. Okay, swap arm quickly if you need to. Ready to snap. Three, two, one, go straight away. You know you're gonna have rest after this, so come on. Nice, and then hold on. Keep pushing. Right to the end. And now you stop. Only one more. Only one. Okay, this tells us we've got 20 seconds to get ready for our last round. Okay guys, last one, let's make it the best. Three, two, one, squat. Good. Remember depth, guys, as well. We need to go parallel or below. Very good, Alex. Really deep. Swap hand if you need to. Come on, don't give up now. Squat, squat, squat. Okay, two, one, snatch. On straight into it. No, it's only 15 seconds left of it. I say, Helen, come on up. Down on the ground again. Push, push, push. Few more seconds, couple more reps. Two, one, rest. Nice. That's our first part sorted. Now. Catch your breath and pen and paper would be good to know what our metcon is going to look like. So we finally get some sweat in here. So <clears throat> it's going to be a 30 minute work. And we start with a bike. A buy-in of 80 thrusters. Hundred. <laughs> Two. <laughs> okay. So 80 thrusters. Then five rounds of 20 lunges, which I will let you decide according with your weight, with the weight you've got at home, okay? what kind of lunge you're gonna do. Obviously, 20, 20, two zero. Uh, very lightweight, overhead, very heavyweight, maybe at your back, if super mega maxi heavyweight, it's not your good thing, but you're still gonna do it on your back. Um, 30 sit-ups after the 20 lunges. Then, 
some sort of active rest if you want with 40 jumping jacks. Then 30 V-ups and 20 burpee over the weight you were using for thrusters. Okay, dumbbell, kettlebell, barbell. So, that's five rounds of this. Then, if you have any time left, you fill up the 30 minutes with Turkish get-ups. Okay, now we're going through all the movements. Don't worry, guys. If you got any question, any problem. So, you finish the five rounds before the 30 minutes mark. You anyway work for 30 minutes and you do Turkish get-ups. So, let's have a look at the movements. Buy-in, thrusters. Barbell thrusters, nice, easy, bring it up here. Squat, push up your head to full extension, okay. If you've got a dumbbell, and as or a kettlebell, okay. Obviously, you need to be a single arm thruster. You do same amount each side. Then lunges, as I said, it's only 20 lunges, guys, so make it challenging. Goblet lunges, overhead lunges, front rack, back rack lunges, try to make them a little bit more spicy, okay? Then 30 setups, have a mat, a towel, a pillow here, okay? All the way back, all the way forward. That's okay. Jumping jacks, easy. All the way up here. Then V ups. If you are uh, comfortable in doing full option V ups, that's fine. So both legs coming up at the same time. Okay. Touching your toes. If not, one leg at a time. Then burpee over. Got your whatever kind of weight here. Okay. Do your burpee, get down, coming up, and then a decent jump over the object. Okay, before you do your next burpee. The Turkish get ups, that's the most tricky one. You need a single hand weight for this, like I'm doing with the barbell. So, lying down on the floor. One arm is working, straight up here. Same knee is up there. You sit up first, okay? Then, this uh, foot and this hand, push it far away, go into the lunge position, you start up. Reverse process, pose back to the ground. Okay, so you basically are standing up while having an arm straight. I'll be here anyway once we get there. It's gonna be a long journey before getting there. Have we got any question? Val, can I just confirm? Because my husband was mowing the lawn, was it 20 lunges? 30 setups, 40 jumping jacks, 20 V-ups, and 20 burpees over the bar. 30 V-ups. 30, 30 V-ups. Yes. So it's 20, 30, 40, 30, 20. That's what, it. What weight for the bar, Val? For the thrusters. Yeah. You can 25, I guess. 25, okay. I'm 80. <laughs> I was thinking the bar. Hmm? Just thinking just the bar. No, 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 no. no. I don't like, I don't like the way you think. <laughs> okay, let's get this done, guys. It's half hour of beautiful exercise and muscles moving. So. The five rounds, Val. So, it's 80 thrusters as a buy-in, so you just do. And then the five rounds. Five rounds. Right. Got time, Turkish girls. Okay. Ready for thrusters in 10 seconds. 
five, four, three, two, one. Let's thrust. Okay. Beautiful, guys. Even if we might have a light weight, let's try to keep a really good posture while doing it. Okay, and let's not lean too far forward. Let's get rid of those 80 reps, you bunch of athletes. That's awesome, I had a long time. Good. Make sure you break reps down so that you can actually sustain 80. Okay, breathe and then go again as soon as you're ready. Awesome, guys. As soon as your thrusters are gone, into the five rounds, starting with lunges. See some people are there. We all have different weights and conditions, guys, so don't really stress.
I said, Scott, well done. You don't need to swap hand each time, Scott. You can do 10 with one hand and then 10 with the other one. Well, guess next, next round. Brilliant, guys. Very good, V ups. Well done. I see awesome reps. All the way up with your hands, Scott. Come on, up, up, up. Yes. Good. Whatever exercise you are at now, guys, make sure you keep focusing on good form. We're at the 10 minutes mark, but we don't have the thrusters to be done anymore, so thrusters are gone forever. Perfect, Annette, well done. That's really good.
Don't give up. Come on. Keep working hard, guys. You need to find your pace. There are some harder exercises, some easier exercises. You need to know how fast you can go with each. Um, Annette, we only do Turkish get-ups after the five rounds. It's okay, it's fine. Extra fitness for you. So once you've done the bar piece, you're back to lunges. It's okay, it's fine, it's okay. We're halfway through the 30 minutes, guys. Let's see if we can get through the five rounds. If we don't, don't worry, it's still 30 minutes of work.
You're all doing great, guys. Moving fast. Amazing. Come on. Right, come on, it's not time to stop yet. We've got five rounds to go through. Keep pushing hard, guys. Try not to lose that pace of yours. Come on, Alex. One baby up, up, up. Come on, try not to stop for too long, people. Back to work as soon as you can.
On side up. Yes. Awesome jump. What exercise is that, Pauline? <laughs> You're right. Okay. Not too long to go, six minutes. That's what we have to do. Six minutes of workout and that's the end. Awesome burpees juice. Come on, next one. Let's go. Yes. Stay in the game, guys. Stay with your mind in the game. Come on, three minutes. What about one leg at a time, but straight, Aggie? Keep pushing as hard as you can with all the energy you've got left because that's the last two minutes, not even two minutes to go.
Final sprint. 45 seconds, come on. Let's get a couple more reps in. Five seconds. Come on. Four, three, two, one. Rest. Amazing job, everybody. It's already finished. You wouldn't believe so, but it's already finished. Well done.